Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome to a new Let's Try series. Today we're gonna be checking out Zedon or Zedon, whatever you wanna pronounce it. Today we're gonna be checking out. Now this game came out on Steam Early Access in last June. I actually planned to play it back then, but then, you know, things happened and I never did. Uh, it's developed and published by Golden God Games, and well, it's still in early access and uh, receiving frequent updates. So here I am playing it. It's a um, kind of felt like a zombie apocalypse simulation game uh, where you're playing a map, kind of similar to maybe Battle Brothers, the main world map, and you move around and then you, you know, you talk, you fight, you try to survive, basically. I've not played it yet. This is what I know from Steam page, so we're gonna run in and just start a new game, see how things go. I guess we can start new, uh, we can choose new starting survivors. Alright. Okay, that's kinda cool. Uh, this is, I guess, how many we get? Two, four, six. We're gonna go with normal, hard, and sadistic, huh? Oh, that's really nice. Uh, let's change your portrait. Actually, can we name these people? Oh, that's great. Let's get Nuke in here. Let's uh, change your portrait. Let's see, do we have a Nuke out there? I don't know. Nuke, this is, I guess, how you're gonna look now. Is that okay? I hope it's okay. Andrew, uh, this is clearly Lucian. Yeah. Uh, let's get Peggy in here. Let's get lost in here uh, let's get infinity in here uh, who's gonna be infinity this is gonna be infinity hey Anthony what did it just all change what the hell <laughs> stop it oh my god it just reset all my names hey nook yes uh, Lucian yes uh, we had Peggy here, we had Lost over here, we had Infinity over here, and we had Hashem over here. Okay, now, what are you gonna be? Medic, Civil Engineer? I would like to have a Medic. That seems cool. Uh, build twice as fast. Cultivate twice as fast. Philosopher, Mechanic. Politician, zombie actor, architect, unemployed, chef, police, medic. Uh, you get to be electrician, Lucian. You get to be civil engineer, for sure. Lost is a philosopher. No, Lost is gonna be... Um, where is he? Lost usually gets to shoot stuff in my game, so you get to be police guy. Uh, let's see, Peggy. Hmm. I think Peggy, you can be medic. Yeah. Infinity is a nurse. Well, well, oh, we have military over here. That wasn't an option before, was it? You know what? Infinity, you get to be a lumberjack. And Hashem? Uh, Hashem, you're a chef. Yes. All right, let's go with normal difficulty. I don't want to go with hard or sadistic, just, just normal. Shall we? Let's do it. Let's begin. Welcome to Zedon. A small tutorial will go through the basics to make sure you're ready to survive. Alright, I like that. Continue. You can move the camera by holding the left mouse button and move it. Turning, you can use WASD. Oh, the camera is a bit crazy. Alright, let's select our survivor group. Alright, alright, alright. These are the survivors that belong to the group. Each turn a survivor group has two action points. Without the action points, you can press the next turn button. Alright? Uh, with a group selected, press the inventory button or E key. This inventory contains all items of this group. With the inventory open, press any portrait card to open survivor information. Oh, okay. So we have Nuke, 13 HP. Okay, looks like Infinity has the least HP. The other Lumberjack, alright. <coughs> Normal hunger levels. Strength, speed, focus, endurance, intelligence. Uh, so this is for melee weapons and carry capacity. Okay. A speed is dodge and attack. Focus is the ability to use firearms. Endurance is the HP. And intelligence is crafting. 
All right. Good. And then I guess you can put clothing in here. Accessory, accessory, weapon. Cool, we have no weapons. We have Lucian over here. Lost. Piggy. Infinity. Yeah, he's focused. <laughs> Hash of... Wait, uh, you were a police officer. Lost. Yeah, your focus, focus is not good. But that's okay. Uh, we do have some guns. Look at that. We have handguns, we have uh, knives, and we have a baseball bat and our knife. And a bunch of ammo. Alright. Let's uh, see. Uh, definitely want to give you a pistol since you are a police officer. Kablam. Do we need to give you ammo? Uh, right click and then you tell it to move. Okay, yeah. I, don't, I hope... I hope this all just, you know, goes... Everybody can use that. I hope so. Uh, let's give... I think I saw you have three focus. So let's give uh, Lucian a weapon as well. And then, well, the rest... Baseball bat does more damage, I think. Let's see. All melee weapons get extra attack. Let's get you, Infinity. You get to use the baseball. And well, the rest, you get just have knives. <laughs> You just get knives, and that's okay. Let's give you a weapon, and let's give you... Can I put this in accessory? No. So I guess you just use it. Alright, that, that's fine. And of course, Chef will definitely need a melee weapon. Okay. That's good. We have some canned food. We have a survival tent. And some firearm. Firearm stuff. Good. Okay. Now, uh, both inventories... When action points run out, just hit next turn. Okay, well, let's move towards the north. That was one action point. Oh, I guess that's it. Still have one. Attack power. Now it's time to build an encampment. It must be built on a non-forest tile. It's recommended to build an encampment far from roads and with the best possible line of sight. Well, let's build an encampment. This is Q. It's going to consume one action point. Yes, let's build it over here. So we have an encampment. Excellent, your encampment is built. Now let's check it out. Press the Manage Encampment button. Alright. These are the available buildings to build. You can store and scrap items in the encampment storage. Since you don't have any resources to build anything, it's better to collect wood first. Okay. Resources collected are automatically stored at the encampment storage. You can change this option on the option panels. You can access the storage by clicking the storage button in the left side of the encampment panel. I will definitely remember all of these. Uh, with your group selected, move them to a forest style, then press the collect wood button. Alright. Well, you guys. Actually, we're gonna click next button because you guys don't have any action points. Um, where is the next button? Ah, there it's up here. Space for next turn. Good. Alright, we're turn two. Now, move here. Collect wood button. Hey, good. It's all nicely on Q, which doesn't work, apparently. Yes, I'm sure. Smag that wood. This group is assigned to collect wood. Each turn, some wood will be collected. More members in a group means more wood. That concludes the small tutorial. You need to start exploring to find other resources and items. All right. Let's uh, end the turn. Achievement unlock. I can survive. Beautiful. One wood collected. All right. Uh, how about you guys stop collecting wood? Yes, let's uh, let's move to this road over here. And next turn, I guess we're gonna leave that encampment there. How's uh, actually our inventory? Yeah, we left the tents behind. Is that smart? I would actually like to pick up the tents. I don't necessarily wanna stay here. Um, manage the encampment. Can I pick it up? Pack up a uh, encampment. Yes, let's pack it up. Let's go back to the road. Hell yeah. Yeah, we really don't have many action points per turn, man. So let's plop and plop. We're gonna follow... Oh, look, there's a city. We built this city on... Zombie land. Well, let's go to a city. We found a location. Press enter location button. All right. Good, you can see the small icons indicating what type of items you can find in the area. Select the area you wish to explore and click on a survival portrait to sign or you can drag and drop the survival portraits in the air to explore. Each turn your survivors may found 
items. Alright, select the area you wish to explore, then just click on a survival portrait to assign. When there's only one area, you can just click a portrait to assign. Thirdly, you can drag and drop. Okay, apartment and houses, we can find clothing, accessories, food, medical items in hospital, commercial stores, clothing, resources, food, utility services, weapons, clothes, and accessories. Let's just go over here. Uh, let's go to commercial stores. Yeah? So I can uh, assign you. Let's assign two people over here. And let's go exploring this one as well. Let's assign maybe you two. Actually, let's do three each. Yeah. And let's do next turn. So, uh, do I just do next turn? And they might find something? Hmm. Are you guys... They, it says that they're exploring. Okay, oh, it's 0 0.1 explored. Whoa, what was that? Zombies kill while defending. Eight. Oh boy, we killed eight zombies apparently? I uh, killed more. That actually scared me. You found a survivor who was just bitten by a zombie. Oh no, what do I do? Uh, we can amputate. Leave him to his fate. Immediately... Intimidate to steal her items. Let, well, I'm gonna try to amputate her. I'm sure that's gonna go well. Amputation was successful. He joined us. Well, who do we have? Um, let's actually check you. So we got George. It said it was a female, but it's a female George, so I'll take that. We did use some ammo already. Well, welcome to the squad, female George. I mean, I don't judge if you. Oh my god. Um, there's a lot of zombies over here. Oh, it looks like they're just coming in. Oh boy, is anyone getting hurt? Oh yeah, oh yeah, they're getting hurt. No, are, did we find anything in this city yet? Uh, how do I click on the city? Here we go. We explored 0 0.2 of this area, 0 0.1 of this area. That's just horrible. Um, you know what? Let's uh, get you off the exploring over here. And let's just combine all of you here. Maybe that's going to make you explore faster. I think this might be a bad idea with all the zombies around here. There's a lot of them. I mean, we're all fighting. I wonder if you can even run. Yes, let's, let's move away. Uh, they're chasing me. They're definitely chasing me. Okay. Uh, oh, nice. We stabbed these guys in the face. We're defending. Mm, let's move here. Oh, my God. Hunter of Zombies. Achievement unlocked. I think we killed 100 already. Holy shit. When this game said that you can play on Harder Brutal... This is not what I expected. Nice, these guys get killed. Defend. Move. Let's see if we can outrun the zombie hordes. We only get one action point, probably because we are next to them. Let's see if we can lose them in the forest. No, we might get be only getting one action point because of reasons. Hmm. I wonder why we only have one action point now and before we had more. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna flee a bit further. And over here, we don't have action points. We're gonna build uh, the encampment. Yes. Let's see if we can. Uh, we need 26 wood. Uh, great. Spiked wall. Oh boy, you need a lot. These, the, the, there were so many of these zombies. I hope we can heal up. Water tower. Maybe you can build a lot though. I like that. You can build a gym. There's the storage. So there's all the storage. We have one construction material, zero wood. Did we not gather one wood at some point? Let's do a next turn. Mm. Can I like do... 
just half of the group to go uh, here. Let's have you collect wood. Oh, right. Let's have you collect wood. So, I just, just press that and they're gonna keep on collecting wood. Well, the turns are going pretty fast. Hope we get food. Are you gonna guys like heal up? Do I... They get to heal you up? I mean, we do have a medic somewhere. How much wood have we collected? Plenty actually. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. We need like 4 more for something. Alright, let's go back. Okay. And now we can build a wooden wooden wall. We can build a defense. Or a spiked wall. For spiked wall we need just a bit more. Ah, low chance almost get No, let's just build a wooden wall. Let's build it. Uh now. Who my survivor? She's good for this stuff. I think Nuke was a yeah, Nuke was a construction worker. Alright. So let's uh Let's assign Nuke to build us. 25 turns left. I wonder if I can uh, assign more people and it's gonna be built fast. Ah, yeah. Let's assign... George, what are you good at? Probably nothing. Let's assign you guys. Let's assign maybe Peggy as well. You guys build us. 10 turns. Now, how do I... Just move you? Now, I'm gonna dismiss you. Now if I do this, actually let's do next turn. Now if I do this, it moved all of them. That's not good. That's not, yeah, that's not good. Alright, well, all of you get to build this then. It's gonna at least be built faster. Six turns. Alright, we can do that. How, how much longer? Three, two, one. Bam! Wooden wall has been built. We have wooden wall over here. That's amazing. I hope. My guys still haven't uh, healed up. Even though we have this. I'll reserve 5 HP to all. Do you want to do that quite yet? Not quite yet. Not everybody is injured. There you go. We can split the groups over here. Okay, that's... That's the way we need to do it next time. Okay, now, what else can we build around here that we just might need wood for? Nothing, pretty much. <laughs> pretty sure. Nothing. Uh, that's okay, though. Well, let's, uh, let's go explore a bit further, then. Yeah. I mean, we have, we have this encampment over here to flee to if we need to. I wonder if we only have one move point because we're injured. Uh, and you know what? I need to check this out. Let's uh, do this. Did it do it? Uh, how do you do it? I don't want to right click to throw away. Hmm. That's a good question. Ah, oh, to consume medic only. She's the medic. Ah, there you go. Okay, you need to use it with the medic. Uh, crafts a basic bag every 100 turns. Nice. Increased amputation effect. So, um, I can also decrease hunger levels if I <laughs> click this. Oh, just on her. Okay. That's not really good. We need more food then. Some of them also got some XP. But I need way more. Alright. Uh, let's keep on moving. Yeah, we still have like one... Oh, there's zombies. Hello? <coughs> well... Fight them. <coughs> fight them some more. Oh, Lucian got hurt. <coughs> nice! Killed them. Oh, we have found a medical item. Okay, we got the uh, painkillers. It restores 6 HP to a person. 
Don't need that quite yet. Don't think anybody is missing 6 HP. It's just a bit annoying that we are so slow at moving. <laughs> but I mean, if every 100 turns we get a new medical bag, this is not too bad. Okay, there's a town over here. It's not a city, it's a town. Let's enter it. Okay. Now we'll see if there's anybody moving closer. Uh, but I would like to find clothing and food would be great. There's also weapons over here. Unlikely to find. Average likelihood. Average. Very unlikely. Let's, uh, let's go to the houses. Let's just go search houses. And everybody go search houses. Yeah. Wow, this exploring really takes a while. Oh, Hashem found a cloth. Hashem, you beast. It's a cosplayer jumpsuit. Focus, endurance, and intellect. Um, who do we want to do give that to? Uh, probably our main focused guy. A police officer gets to have a cosplayer suit. Nice, I like this. All right. I'm gonna finish the episode here. We are gonna keep on exploring this this game and seeing what it has to offer. For now, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider dropping a comment down below. Should like subscribe and see more do magic, and I'll see you next time. Check out.